Now let's say we want to cut our um, box out of the center of our stock. Um, and it's the same material and kind of the same job. What I can do is I can right click here on machining operation and copy that. Then if I select the mach um, my machining operation set and go to paste, it will paste that um, machining operation back in there. Now, I can also double click on here. Oops. I can click in this box and name this holes. Uh, so I've got one that's named holes and one that na that's named edge. But my edge one, if we open it up and look at it, it's got, it's still relating to the all the same geometry as the other one because I copied it. So we want to we don't want to cut it again, so we'll remove all by clicking that down here and select curves as region again and we're going to just select my outside curve and hit return. And then we've got one region, we've got that outside curve. My tool is going to stay the same, my feeds and speeds are going to stay the same, clearance is the same, cut parameters will change because I want to cut on the outside of that square to give me the exact size of that square. So I'm going to switch that from outside to inside. Cut levels are going to stay the same, entry, exit, sorting, all the same. Now I can hit generate and we can zoom in here and see I'm going to cut on the outside of that, and uh, I got three passes. If I look at here, that I can see it's not going um, crazy far below. But I am going to have a problem. And if we look, it the machining operations hop, happen top down. So the first thing it's going to do is cut out my edge, and then it's going to cut the holes in the center. Um, so my stock is going to get smaller once it cuts out that edge. The you know the the amount of surface area I have holding this thing down is going to be smaller. So what would be better if I cut my holes in the center first and then cut out the edge last? And uh, it, that's easy to fix just by drawing, dragging. You the holes up to the top and now my holes cut first and my edge cuts second. Um,